waking up here Saturday morning. <clears throat> Got some good sleep. Yeah, good. good sleep. Uh, dinner was a uh, so-so or miniature, I should say. Miniature wings. Miniature wings. But no, it was good. It was convenient, real close um, to the hotel. Uh, stayed over here at the Marriott. Uh, and then we just got to head over right over there for an 8.30 start. I got the bike all loaded up. Uh, got to fuel up and then meet the rest of the group. I did review some of the footage from from day one and I'll link that video up there one thing I noticed that I did not like was this windshield reflected kind of the gas tank and I think it takes away from some of the view uh, but I'll see what you all think and I'll have to play around with it try to figure out how to get the the video a little better we're gonna pop over here get some fuel and then meet up with everyone else a little foggy this morning always seems to be the mo morning So just left the hotel. Unfortunately, Pete is not feeling the greatest. He's got some kidney stones. So bringing up the rear today. Just leaving Lewisburg, gonna head out on 60 West, work our way to Babcock State Park. And got just about an hour ride over there. That was some fun roads on 60. So a quick ride out to Babcock State Park. Got some water flowing. I'm gonna check this out, get a few pictures. It was just about an hour ride over here. Uh, amazing roads. Got out of the fog, the sun came out. I think it's gonna be an awesome day. All right, another good stop at Babcock State Park. A couple stickers, some pictures. A little climbing on the rocks. Good time. Now we're headed to New River Gorge. I think it's a quick ride over there. I think Mario said 26 miles. And that gets us one stop closer to Pies and Pints. You all look cute over there.
All right, so just finished up there at the bottom of a New River Gorge bridge. First time at the, the bottom, that was uh, pretty cool seeing it from a different perspective. Now we're uh, short riding over to Pies and Pints, so let's go ahead and fast forward to some amazing pizza. Cue sexy music. Now it's a party. All right, so leaving pies and pints here. I think I was so hungry. I don't even think I took a picture of the food, but great lunch, great pizza as always, a nice cold beer, and a bunch of water because it's getting uh, warm out. But we're just headed it down here to the gas station, and then we have about 150 miles uh, left for the day. Uh, but should be some heavy riding for the afternoon. And we'll probably have a stop in there just to, to get a break. And But headed into Elkins, West Virginia for the night. That warning light always freaks me out. It said no key in range. And I think I feel, it makes me feel like I forgot my key. Key's in my pocket, so that's good news. All right, so we'll fuel up and then we'll uh, jump back in when we're uh, on the road. So just coming in here to Marlington, got about 65 miles to Elkins where we're stopping for the night, but uh, going to do a little stretch break, water break, and then uh, hammer out the rest. It's uh, 4 o'clock, so we should get in just after 5. Alright, back at it. 60 some miles. Got Justin Barsha out there on the wall. Back when he's up from a, on a Suzuki, it's a long time ago. Liquors and more, that's where that guy was headed.
The man! The myth, the legend. As you all remember, Pete was dealing with some kidney stones, went to the hospital, took care of that, and uh, he's back. You can't keep him down.